Presidon, the hit Netflix series is known for its intricate storytelling and the hidden Easter eggs that tie into the romances central to each season. In the first part of season 3, the show's writers have cleverly intertwined the love story of Colin Brelston and Penelope Featherington with the classic Greek myth of Eros and Psyche. The myth of Eros and Psyche is a tale of love, jealousy and perseverance. Psyche, a mortal princess, is so beautiful that she attracts the worst of people, overshadowing even the goddess of love, Aphrodite. Out of jealousy, Aphrodite sends her son Eros to make Psyche fall in love with the beast. However, Eros falls for Psyche himself and pricks himself with his own arrow. They marry with the condition that Psyche must never know his true identity. Curiosity drives Psyche to break this promise and upon discovering Eros' identity, he leaves her. Psyche then undertakes a series of impossible tasks set by Aphrodite, eventually succeeding and reuniting with Eros. Jess Bronnell, the showrunner for Brazilton, revealed in an interview with People that this myth was suggested by one of the show's researchers. They found remarkable parallels between the ancient tale and the evolving relationship of Colin and Penelope. In Brazilton, Colin, Luke Newton, and Penelope, Nicola Coughlin, start Season 3 at odds due to Colin's hurtful remark at the end of Season 2. Colin, seeking to make amends, offers to help Penelope charm potential suitors, which gradually rekindles their friendship and sparks deeper feelings. However, Colin is still unaware that Penelope is Lady Whistledown, the notorious gossip columnist. The comparison between Colin and Penelope's story and the myth of Eros and Psyche is evident. Penelope's dual life as Lady Whistledown mirrors Psyche's hidden knowledge of her husband's true identity. Both women face immense challenges that test their relationships and personal resilience. In Bristol, Penelope's hidden identity as Lady Whistledown creates a significant obstacle for her and Colin akin to Psyche's trials. Colin's disdain for Lady Whistledown complicates his relationship with Penelope, especially after the columnist nearly ruins his sister Eloise's reputation. Season 3's balls are carefully designed to reflect the themes of each episode. In episode 4, the Eros and Psyche Ball, hosted by Queen Charlotte, aligns with the episode's exploration of heart versus head. During the ball, Penelope and Colin's budding relationship is highlighted as they watch a ballet performance based on the myth. The ball also features a fresco of Eros and Psyche on the floor, further emphasizing the connection. As the season progresses, Colin has had to prove himself to Penelope, but the part 2 of season shifts the focus to Penelope's secrets. Pranil hints that Penelope will face her own impossible task as she grapples with revealing her true identity to Colin. This dynamic is expected to add significant tension and drama to their relationship. The introduction of the Eros and Psyche myth into Bristol's third season adds a rich layer of symbolism and depth to Colin and Penelope's story. As viewers eagerly await the second part of the season, set to release on June 13, they can look forward to seeing how these ancient themes play out in the vibrant world of Bristol. With intricate storytelling and deeply developed characters, Bristol continues to captivate its audience, blending timeless myths with residency era romance. That's all for today's video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.